Hi folks, I'm Steve Judd, I'm an astrologer and this is my astrological forecast for the sign of Virgo for November 2010. Um, for some of you it's quiet, really, for some of you it is quiet. Those of you born in September through to about say September the 12th, first 12 days of September, if you're lucky enough to be born then it's quiet and if it's working don't fix it. Those of you born in August are likely to find that a number of buttons are going to get pushed over November and particularly in the first two weeks of particularly the second week of November you may well find that you become more exposed more vulnerable more open to criticism from other and the hard I mean you don't work well with criticism Virgo is hard enough on itself it doesn't need criticism from others but um, don't let it get to you don't beat yourself up no matter what other people say because you're responsible for your actions you are not responsible for other people's reactions and as long as you're doing your best and you're acting with the cleanest of conscience and the best of integrity i see absolutely no reason for you to give yourself any grief and if people don't like it when you've done your best that's their problem tell them to clear off simple you haven't got time to allow other people to mess about with your emotions and those of you born on or after september the 12th 13th take your time I realize that there's a lot of situations around you which may feel very urgent and very immediate but these are not going to transpire properly until after Christmas stroke New Year so don't let the hype and spin get to you Virgo it's a reactive month so react in ways that you'll be proud of in months to come don't jump over don't go over the top don't go for the jugular have a considered month Hope you've enjoyed listening. You can find me at birthdaymatcher.com, best birthday matching site in the world. You can find me on my own website at stevejudd.com. That's where I do all my astrological services from, as well as blogging every so often. And you can find me, if you Google the Caustic Astrologer, you will come up with rebellious, radical, hardcore, 21st century, both conventional and cultural and unconventional astrology, mixed with some absolutely wicked beats on glastonburyradio.com irregular broadcast live on average two or three times a month google the caustic astrologer enjoy